Greetings, friends. Welcome to today's Family Altar Audio Devotional. Our scripture reading today comes to us from the book of 1 Timothy, chapter 3, verse 16. And the quote is by William Marion Branham from the message entitled, What Was the Holy Ghost Given For? This message was preached on December the 17th, 1959. We hope that you are blessed today as you listen. And without controversy, great is the mystery of godliness. God was manifest in the flesh, justified in the spirit, seen of angels, preached unto the Gentiles, believed on in the world, received up into glory. Now we know what the Holy Spirit is. We found out last night that it's God. Now, when we think of God the Father, as Jesus spoke of here, His Father, God the Son, as Jesus, God the Holy Spirit, as what we call it today. Now that does not mean that there is three individual distinct gods. It means that there is one God in three offices. May we say it like this. All that God was, He poured into Christ because He emptied Himself and poured it into Christ and Christ was the fullness of the Godhead bodily. Amen. All that Jehovah was, He poured into Christ. And all that Christ was, He poured into the church. Amen. Not into one individual, but into the entire body. There where we come together in unity, we have power. All that God was was in Christ and all that Christ was is in you. For God was made flesh and dwelt among us. 1 Timothy 3.16 If you're putting it down. Without controversy, great is the mystery of God in the list, For God was manifested in the flesh. We handle Him. God, Jehovah, made flesh and walked on the earth and we saw Him with our eyes. You know, in the same chapter of John 14, Philip said, Lord, show us the Father and it will satisfy us. Jesus said, I've been so long with you, Philip, and you don't know me? When you have seen me, you have seen the Father. And why sayest thou unto me, show us the Father? God was made flesh. Now, here it is. The Father was God over you. We're saying we've been since Adam. God the Father was over Moses and the children of Israel in a pillar of fire. Then God with us in Christ walked with us, talked with us, eat with us, slept with us. God over us, God with us, and now, Amen. God in us. Amen. All God was coming to Christ, all Christ was coming to the church. What is it? God working in you. Anywhere in the world, He'd want to call on you right there working in you to do His good will. How we are to thank God for that. God, the Holy Spirit, is sent for the purpose of God living in His church, moving through each age, working out His divine will. When man makes fun of you, they're not making fun of you. They're making fun of him that sent you. Amen. So, 
Jesus said, Blessed are ye when man shall say all manner of evil against you, falsely for my name's sake. Blessed are you. And again, all that live godly in Christ Jesus shall suffer persecutions. For when God made Himself known in Christ, they hated Him. Who hated Him worse? The church. The church hated Him worse. They hated Him worse than the, the drunkard. They hated Him worse than all the other people. It was the church that hated Him. So therefore, when you see cosmos, the world or the world know Him not, means the church so-called knew Him not. He came to His own and His own received Him not. But as many as did receive Him, to them gave He the power to become sons of God. Amen. To them that believed on His name. Oh, how we should love Him and worship Him. Amen. The purpose of God wanting to become in fellowship. We trust that you have been blessed by God's Word today. The devotional you just heard was derived from Brother Tim Dodd's Family Altar devotional book. If you are interested in a copy of your own, you can visit store.bibleway.org to order your own copy. If you would like to listen to more daily Family Altar audio devotionals, and other spiritual message-related content that we produce, we invite you to subscribe to the 10,000 Worlds Podcast or visit us on YouTube, Facebook, and on our website at 10kworlds.com. That's the number 10, the letter K, and the word worlds.com. If you feel that this ministry has been a blessing to you and you would like to support us financially to help us deliver more and better content to you in the future, you may easily do so by clicking the Consider Supporting Us link in the description of this episode or visiting our website to learn more. It's okay if you can't support us financially, but would you do us a favor, pray for us, and share this episode with others so that they might be blessed as well. Lastly, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell button so that you get notified when we publish more content like this. Thank you, and God bless you.